and show you an example of how business process management and enterprise content management can be integrated together. I took this example from Activity in Action. Activity is an open source enterprise con uh, activity is an open source business process management application which helps in designing your business processes and Alfresco is an enterprise content management system where it uh, helps you to manage documents, versioning and all the stuff. Alfresco itself has an em embedded uh, activity as a workflow engine. So let me show you an example of a fictitious bank banking application where the user tries to apply for a loan and our workflow tries to check the credit of the application and then decides whether to approve the loan or not. So here is a simple decision table which where we have defined our rules. Each rule uh, like depends upon the loan amount being applied, whether it's approved, manager approval or denied. In case of loan amount is less than 10,000, it gets approved automatically. However, in case of a loan amount which is greater than or equal to 10,000, needs a manager approval. And if the loan amount is greater than 10,000, then it gets rejected automatically. In case of like uh, the income is less than the amount of loan being applied, it gets rejected automatically. It doesn't even come to the decision table. So first step what the business process does is it checks for the credit credit check it checks for the credit so it checks whether loan amount income is greater than uh, loan amount so that's where it checks it should be less than that amount and then we start our business process okay let's go to my uh, activity explorer and let's say assume start the process i've logged in as the user who wants to apply for the loan so i just start the process i type in the username email address i type in the income say i have uh, say thousand and I apply for loan for maybe 300 I complete the task okay so I have completed the task so what happens is like the loan my income is thousand and I have applied loan for 300 so it will check whether uh, my income is greater than loan amount so it gets approved automatically so let's go to our enterprise content management system and see like uh, what happened to our loan okay it created a file with folder with my name i open the folder okay here is my application let me see what happened okay it says like okay so my loan amount got approved because my income is uh, more than amount i applied for okay next i'll show you a scenario where income gets uh, sorry the loan gets rejected so i go back to the process i go back to the select the process start the process i fill in my name i fill in my name and, uh, all the details okay now i have my loan is thousand income is thousand i apply for a loan of two thousand i complete the task okay let's go back to my location and see like what's the what has been done okay this is the latest file i open this file okay so since my loan loan am, uh, amount is more than my income it's been rejected automatically okay let's go back to the decision table so we have seen like if it is less than 10000 it gets approved so we'll check for this condition where my uh, loan amount is more than 10000 i go back to the activity explorer this is where i have defined and deployed my process so this is the process handle a loan request with CMIS. 
start process I just go back again I fill in my name my income okay I'll put my income as say 50,000 and I apply for a loan of say 12,000 okay and complete the task okay so I've done that so I go back to my uh, enterprise content management system to verify if there is any file was generated any PDF file regarding my approval so this is the last PDF file which was generated and I don't have any other file this file is just recording that I have uh, applied for a loan let's go and see what's in this document it just says like I have applied for a loan and whether what happened to my credit check okay so it says my name the amount I have applied for loan and it says credit check is okay so since it needs a manager approval let let me log in as the manager in the activity explorer I log in as the manager for this application I log in and I see that there is one task queued in I open the task okay it shows it displays all the details like name amount income so I just have to claim this task so it's still in the queue so someone has to claim so since I am a part of uh, this user Muhammad is part of a manager group I just claim this task okay so here is the document which says like uh, uh, it has all the details it is same this is the same document which is there in, in the in the enterprise content management system this has been added to the process itself so here from here I can go and say yes approve and say check ok some some notes saying that check ok and I complete the task so this is a one step where the manager has to approve let's see the file gets generated here the PDF approval it gets automatically checked into the enterprise content management system another task can be like it, this uh, PDF file can directly be emailed okay it says like it's been approved so this the simple process it says like how it uh, how enterprise content management system and Alfresco could be integrated together